to run. Um, I honestly believe that the, I think the turn thing is like fun, but I like that the fact that it's like a turn. You, you, there's the added pressure and stuff like that. However, I feel that I feel that they need to extend the timer by at least four turns per mission for every mission because there are some cases where you're you're moving forward every single time. You're doing perfectly, taking them out, and you still don't have enough time because you just can't get through the aliens. Um, and if you stealth part of it. And skip pods and stuff like that, and go to, and go like halfway in. It's you can get the mission, but it's very, very like it's still cutting it close, even though you do some dashes in stealth to get closer, because you're still fighting your way. It's what I really think that they should do. There's two different things they can do. They need to either extend the timers, or on those missions with the timers that you have to do something. Because it's a gorilla op, they should give you the option to leave and not have to kill all of the aliens. Um, because if you leave without killing all of the aliens in those missions, you you get a mission fail, which I don't understand. I think you should get a mission successful, but you should get like maybe half of the loot, or maybe or maybe just a small drawback to just leaving early. Uh, because the reason you stay around, obviously, is so you can secure all the loot. Um, however, the objective is to do the objective, so you shouldn't fail the mission if you do the objective and leave. That's how I feel about the missions. There's two different fit ways they can improve them. I st I think they're a bit off, and if you think they're hard in veteran, wow, they're fucking hard in this mode too. Um, so anyway, what was I doing? So this is going to be clear soon. I was going to build the proving ground here. Um, this is going to be a power... Okay. So there's nothing I can do right now. Well, engineering just got some more money. I already have these stuff. <sighs> do I want the act blade yet? It's I don't really ever use my melee weapon, so no, I don't want it yet. Now scale vest is a waste of money because if you lose it then it's gone and it costs too much just for one extra health and takes up a slot where you can use more useful items. What have I got here? Berserker autopsy, alien machinery, and then the supply drop. Okay, let's see what's going on in the bridge now that I cleared the thing. So the time is not the time has stopped and this is being backtracked. Alright. Yes, I know, I don't have long to get this area. Um but I'm gonna be greedy and run the timer. So, so here's the thing you can do in this game: uh, is you can run the timer. So when this fills up, you get thirty, like thirty days. On this difficulty, it's twenty-five to stop the timer. So you just keep stopping the timer in the last ten days, um, and you get more time to do stuff. Uh. What's crazy about this difficulty is this Avatar project accelerates a lot fucking faster than uh, the other difficulties. I, as you can see, I've barely expanded, and yet I've got the Avatar project that's so fucking high, and there's already like two facilities down, and this thing's already got like fucking six bars. It's insane. The outcome of this research can only okay. Our advances, Commander, as if the typical muton wasn't aggressive enough. There is a more time. There is a more time mod hired gun, and you can dis you can actually change the files in in the game to increase or reduce the timers or remove them completely. Um, so yeah, if if it's like that, I mean, if it's that annoying, you can just remove them. Um, yeah, like even even though ah sweet. So here's another thing you can uh, that's cool. If you if you gather enough corpses. Um, you can do the autopsies instantly once your research is completed. It checks to see if you've got enough corpses, and it tells you you can do it instantly. So, it's a good idea to actually just not even bother doing these autopsies until you've gathered enough corpses to do them instantly, because it saves you a lot of time. Although I would expect... I find it unusual. Battlefield medicine. Sweet. So often referred to in the past as the uh, new research. I can do Illyrium now. That gives me access to the 
third tier of things. All of these are autopsies, which I don't want to do. So it's a choice between Illyrium or Alien Encryption. Alien Encryption gives me a story based thing, I think. Um, I'll do the Illyrium. Yeah, I, I did a lot of checking up on things. There's so many things, like... Flashbangs, like... Flashbangs stop stun lances from meleeing you. They stop, like... they The flashbangs prevent, like, so many abilities from different, like, uh... To different, like, things. Like, they stop stun lances from meleeing. They stop vipers from using the tongue ability. Um, and I believe poison, maybe. They stop, like, f f like, uh pretty much any melee unit from meleeing. Um, poison stops berserkers as well from meleeing you, so they just stand there and do nothing. Um, so debuff stuff, fire as well stops people from doing stuff. So if you can debuff, if you can have like a, something to debuff enemies, uh, by all means, like look into it, see what it, like find out why you want to use it against certain type of enemies, it's really freaking useful. Especially with stun lances are so overpowered in this game. They're, they're a nightmare. Alright, so the alien machinery just got cleared. Which means I can build my proving ground. Finally. I wanted to build this a lot earlier, but I had to make some difficult decisions on what I wanted to uh, prioritize. Do I have anything free? I have a gremlin that's free. A uh, gremlin... Hmm... I've got an engineer that's free, right? Yeah, I do. So you, Gremlin, go 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 do this stuff. Uh, so you switch over, which means my engineer is free to do this to get my guys to heal up quicker. What's going on here? Is he? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I've got all three in, right? Yeah, okay. Cool, that's good. Now my guys will heal 100% quicker. The Advanced Warfare Center is pretty freaking dope. It also gives you bonus abilities every time the guys get promoted. You can get a, like, a single bonus ability during their whole promotion phase. So now with the guys in there, oh, that's produced it by a lot. That's going to be really helpful now. Cool. Um, alright, so that's sorted. I got a lot of supplies spare, which is really nice. So I have a relay here, which is going to help me expand. Gorilla up. Okay, so... I'll do one... Now that you're watching... Hired gun, I guess I'll do one more mission. So, engineer. What is this? Destroy the relay. Protect the device. Hack the hidden resistance. Now, this is something important to consider is actually what mission it is. What dark event it counters. How difficult it is. Difficulty equals the number of enemies on the map. That's hidden, I don't know what that is. Alloy padding is pretty freaking bad. <laughs> oh no, the my mission won't last that long with this. Like, I just did a story mission with a lot of fucking enemies. This, so, this isn't a story mission, it's just an op. What does this counter? Guarantees reinforcements. So, do I want a counter... Do I want to counter ally padding or guaranteed reinforcements on Gorilla's Ops? The rewards. How much intel do I have? I have plenty of intel. So let's do... Let's get an engineer. I gotta destroy the alien relay. That shouldn't be too bad. Get my sniper ready. Really sick. I'm sorry about that, mate. Sorry to hear that. Uh, I'll give you another tip as well. Um, so, when it comes to the uh, attached weapons, 
If you want to use this weapon with the attachment on it on a different guy, you can just do this. And you get the ability to use this attached weapon on any other soldier you wanted to have. So it means that you can specialize your weaponry and just upgrade like six weapons or like eight weapons in case you lose some. So you can save your best attachments for those eight weapons or something. Alright. So... It looks like I have to sub out one guy. I have to sub out my Grenadier. Okay, so I'll just get another Grenadier. Oh god, all my Grenadiers, grenadiers are wounded. That sucks. Um, Looks like I'll take a... What do I want to take in place of a Grenadier? I guess I'll take another Ranger. Yeah, I'll take another Ranger. Uh, make everything available. Mm. I actually don't have extra attachments for these for this particular weapon. Without a grenadier, that's going to be rough. I guess what I'll do is I'll just I'll just give you the gas grenade. I'll give you the smoke grenade too. So the smoke grenade doesn't count as a grenade, so if you want two grenades, you can do that. Um, battle scanner, I believe there's still faceless around. I'll keep it, it's good utility. Got my medic still, right? Yes, I do. Alright, let's go. I haven't customized these soldiers because... Uh, I don't want to get heartbroken when I lose them in this difficulty. <laughs> Begin. Shen came across an odd series of transmissions. I do think there's too many timed missions, though, in this game. Communications relay transmitting to the Advent network. We can't pass up any opportunities to disrupt their process. It's a gripe with everyone, to be honest, not being able to take their time. Neutralize any hostile contacts near the site, lock it down, and destroy the target. Oh, I'm on a building. Oh, and I can go on the bridge. Two interesting opportunities. Mm -hmm. See how the mutons have like more health and more armor and everyone has more health. It's rough. Alright, let's see if there's anything on my flank. Anything on my flank? Yes, there is. Okay. I'm not too worried about that. It's just two troops. The officer isn't the good officer either, it's just a shitty officer. Okay. Rolling. Understood, moving out. Understood. Moving out. Ambushing this pod here would be pretty uh, beneficial to me. Um in fear of getting spotted, I think I'll just wait one turn. I shouldn't, because there's a timer. Alright, these guys are coming in towards my direction. Well, looks like I'll be fighting five people then. Because I can't afford to waste time, so... Sniper, where are you? You have a shot? I'll think about it. Uh... Where can you guys all move? You can go like there. That's no good. Actually, it's fine. Okay. Uh, you. Where's my grenade? Oh, I don't have a grenadier. I keep forgetting. You go. Who's at the back here? You? You go here. I think it's 
too early to initiate combat. I'll I'll move one more time. I just moved my sniper down like an idiot, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Where can you go? You can go like right here. That's pretty good. Do that. Head into that location. And then last guy to move. Let's put you on the flank, maybe? No. Let's put you by here too. Orders confirmed. Moving out. All right, just Overwatch then. One more turn. What are you guys doing? You're walking that way, huh? Buy some cars. Oh, okay. Two grenades then, and then that'll fuck him up. These guys, I'm not too worried about. They're just basic. Oh, okay. They found us. That's fine, I guess. That's actually... I still get my turn, so this actually might be better. Oddly enough. Provided I get some hits in. He's on fire now, because I have the fire rounds on my sniper. He'll get a free shot on me, I think. Oh, he, he didn't decide to shoot me? Okay. Alright, so how do I want to proceed here? You... There's a lot of enemies. A lot of enemies. So I will... First things first, I think I'll flashbang. Who can I flashbang? Who's the biggest threat? Stunlance is the biggest threat. The Vipers are also threats. I'll think about that later. Let's see who I take out first. Uh, sniper, take your free shot. Who do you want to hit? Who do you want to hit? That's not a good shot. That's a decent shot. Do it. And then you are not in a good position. I need to move you somewhere else. Let's have you here. No problem, boss. Who do you have a shot on? You still have a shot on him? Can you throw a grenade instead? Not on, not anyone useful. Okay, just do do that. All right, the stun lance is dead, so I don't have to worry about him anymore. That gives me more options. Officer is about to have a bad day. Let's see, where can I put you? That's hard cover. What's behind me? Oh, it's just the officer. Is anything to my right? Snakes. That's fine. How do you not have a good shot on that officer? I do not understand. I guess I didn't flank him completely. Hmm. Alright, I'll, I'll go back to you. What do you have shots on? 81 on him? Let's see if I can get that improved here. Oh, like, I don't want to fall. I hate falling back, but... You were flanked. 95, take it. Hmm. Alright. Who's got the stock? Who's got the stock? You do. You have the stock, huh? Okay. Um. Can you shoot the officer? You cannot. Can you get into better cover? Actually, I need to take out the muton. You know what? Go, go into heavy cover. Not a problem. And let's just use this. It's a guarantee. Oh, I can't. That sucks. Um, go there. Headed there now. What do I have on the muton? I don't have a very good shot on him. 
All right, so I have to flashbang that Muton because he's just gonna throw. Who's got the flashbang? Oh, I'm, I'm dumb. Never mind. I'll I use the guy with the flashbang to shoot somebody. Gas grenade will do the trick. Uh, should kill him. Don't like wasting my. I don't like wasting a grenade, but he's too much of a threat to keep up with his plasma grenade, which does like six damage. Alright, so he'll die next turn, he's poisoned. Why did that only do one damage? I'm very confused about that. I have to grenade you because I don't have a guarantee. I could melee you instead. I could, that puts me in a lot of cover. It's not a guarantee, but it puts me in a lot of cover. Alright, that's fine. Well, that's all I've got left is you now, huh? Looks like I have to do this because the poison won't kill him. I thought it would have been enough to kill him. Yeah, combat protocol. Just to make sure he... I know he can't throw a grenade, but he can also do a lot of damage, so... I don't care if the snakes bind my guys. It's not too much of a big deal so long as it doesn't load another pod. So I gotta kill him next. What are you doing? That's mean. That's pretty mean. It's okay, I'll get you, don't worry. I'll save you. Sniper, where are you? Take the shot. You. Where can I put you? You know what, actually? Oh, 64, that's no good. 84, that's, that'll do. Get him. Target asset sighted. Yeah, I've had multiples poisoned before. It's... It's not fun. Uh, let's see. One more snake around. Can I get close to him? Yeah, I can grenade him, get rid of his cover. Let's do that. Get ready for a surprise. Right, there goes his cover. Move up. Take the hundred percenter. Ah, you fucking dodging asshole. Alright, fine. You wanna play that way? Move up. Mmm, 81. 81. Not a guarantee. Neither is a grenade. Are you on fire? Do you have any debuffs? No. I guess I just have to take the chance. Alright, fine. That's good. Thank you. Oh, thanks, hide gun. Believe me, it comes from a lot of practice. I was in... I don't know if you recognize the game World of Tanks, but I was one. I was in, like, leadership in that game for a very long time, uh, where, where I would be essentially commanding a team of, like, 14 people in PvP, which is uh, a lot more stressful than commanding six, uh, five soldiers that don't complain at you if things go wrong. <laughs> And uh, it was like I was in like two different clans. Mid high was my first one I was in, and I was like in leadership for that for like two or two odd years. And then like then I went to a very high end clan and uh, became leadership in there after a while. But I've i I don't play it much anymore. Oh really? Warships is fun. If if the only the only thing I'd have to say about warships is I I think they could make the game a bit quicker. It felt a little like slow, but I don't know if that's just me. I have 
don't have many turns left to fucking. I have to fucking book. I have to go. I also need to get my sniper in in line line of fire here. So where is this thing? It's here. So I need a grenade like this part of the building and get my sniper to kill it. So my sniper needs a line of fire from back like here. So I need to get my sniper across here. So start booking it this way, sniper. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, I'm scared to move forward. My guys aren't really set up right now for... Just move forward one and reload. Please don't alert anyone. Thank God. Okay. Good to go. You guys, if that's the case, then I can move you guys up to... Uh, let's not go through the poison, shall we? Okay, three turns. Uh, let's see. Sniper, do you have line of fire? Oh, so he needs to be. He needs to be like. Let me see here. Fuck me. Uh, da, 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 da. So he needs to be. He needs to be like right here. To shoot it. Okay, thank god I didn't alert a pod. Alright, so, let's go. Everyone move up together. Alright, move you two up, you two can overwatch. And then, you two overwatch and then you two go forward while they're, you're being covered. Uh, this'll do. Yeah, I saw it coming. I knew there were going to be some enemies around here. This is going to be rough. I need to spend a turn killing that, really. And I also need to grenade the entrance. And I need to get it in vision. And I need to take out that shield bearer. There's a lot of and I need to do's right now, so I have to be ballsy here. Grenade. So first off, let's get down here. This is for you. All right. Do I see the objective? Not quite. Okay. I need to see the objective. If I if I want to shoot it with my sniper, I need to see it. I need to trigger it. Heading out. It's not triggered. Just go. Dash forward. We're close. All right, it's triggered. Good. Sniper. Go. All right, you run over there. Do you have a shot on anybody? Overwatch. You run over here. You have a shot on somebody, but it's not a good one. Can you flashbang them? Not without flashbanging my own guys. I can flashbang the shield bearer though. No. Aid protocol. You need to protect my guy that ran forward. Go. More aliens. Good. Ah, it's a long-range shotgun. It's fine. I understand. Shield bearer has to go next turn, though. 
Did he shield bear the objective? No, he didn't. Okay, we're good. In that regard. Jesus! I did not know they could they could see my sniper from there. Oh! Okay, it's dead? Okay, good. It must have been because of the fire rounds, and must have put fire onto the relay. Okay. So the relay's down. But I've got a massive fucking group of enemies to deal with. You... I don't like where you are. I really don't. So go here. I can handle that. And reload. Rock and roll. You need to deal with this shield bearer. Like now. On your order. Don't miss. Jesus. His shield is down. What can I do about him? There, I got a flank on him if I go this way. Oh, God damn, these low percentage chances. It's just so risky right now. It's a guarantee if I hit. Alright, he's dead. All the shields are gonna go down now, huh? Yeah. However, I'm in a very rough predicament right now. Go heal my sniper. You're not in range to flashbang anyone, huh? You can flashbang... What have they got? They've got a viper and two sectoids and... So the only one that's likely to shoot me is this guy, so I probably should just do this. You... You need to be closer to actually make use of your overwatching. You're disorientated. You're just a sectoid being a dick. Uh, overwatch. I'm not- I, I don't like the positioning that I'm in right now, it's pretty- I can get flanked. Alright. Did that kill him? No, it did not. You hit me whilst flashbanged, you asshole. When they get flashbanged, their accuracy goes down a lot. I'm, I'm, I'm not feeling so good here. But unfortunately, it didn't work out. What are you doing? Double moving? Okay, that's fine. What are you doing? You're raising the dead? That's fine too. Yeah, sometimes it happens. Sometimes it's bullshit. With, with this difficulty, there are no modifiers uh, to chance. It's like they get good chances, they get to do stuff or... I, I don't know how to explain it, but in the in the um, in the early difficulties, like the the first two, the percentages are actually put in your favor. They're hidden, but you don't you don't see it, but they are. So the one that's doing the zombie is you. You need to be sorted out. So let's go ahead and before I actually do that, can you go? I need to move you out of the poison. Where is the poison? I can't I don't see it. It seems to have No, it's still there. Hmm. I'll get back to you. What what's my sniper doing? Alright, so can you shoot somebody? You can. Well you may as well try. That's fine, it was a low percentage. You can actually get the sectoid though, which is be pretty cool if you created him, but... I'm not expecting to. Hmm. Ooh, can I use this? Yes, I can. Do it. That should take the zombie out. Oh, 
Alright, two enemy, three enemies left to go. 94. I can get a better chance than that, right? No problem, boss. 94 again. Hmm. Where do I end up being? Can I just do it from here? Yeah. Do it. Okay. Let's move you up. On my way. Kremlin heal. Uh, I want to heal you, but I don't want to put you in a flank shot to this guy. So uh, the best option I've got is to move you, like, back here. Or move you... Ooh. That's not bad. Go there. And then you. Get rid of that poison. Smoke grenade. Or a 53. Or an Overwatch. Overwatch. Alright, that worked out. What are you doing? You're probably gonna go and bind him, right? Yeah, you're fucking. You're gonna bind him. That's fine. And what are you gonna do? Panic. Mind control. Oh, you're raising the dead again. That's fine. I think I've got this now. You can't do anything this turn. Sniper. 50-50. No, you know what? I'll go up and pistol him in the face. What that? That. There. Boom! He's on fire now. That means he can't use any abilities. Uh, what's your chances to hit there? You know, I'll just go up to his face. Whatever you say. Hundred percent. That frees you up to move. So you go. Is that a flank? That's not a flank. That's a flank. That's a flank. Go there. I'm on it. 94. 94 for slash as well. It's a minimum. You know, I'll just slash him instead. Status confirmed. All right, cool. Mission accomplished. Nice. That was fucking hard. That really... The timers, man. It's the timers to stress you out. If I had all the time in the world, I'd be fine. But I didn't. And that's... I like it and I hate it at the same time. I think it's cool, but I also think it's... Infu like, it's stressful as fuck. Basically. <laughs> I didn't miss a single shot, huh? Okay, that's cool. So that wasn't quite an hour and a half, that was more like half an hour. <laughs> Promotions? Oh yeah. Let's see. Field Medic. Get those extra ha uh, heals in. You. F scanning. No, I don't need to bring the Battle Scanner anymore. Uh, you. Oh, running Gun is good. Running Gun is good, but this guy's... I'm making him a scout, so... 
I'll make another I'll make a blade master later. Huh. Hello, Commander. Attack event countered rapid response, so I won't get any extra fucking reinforcements on all the ops. I got an extra engineer, what can you do, Mr. Engineer? Hmm. What can you do? How many slots have I got for this? Eight? Uh, how many injuries do I have? Nine? Wow. I need to heal my guys up. I'll leave my engineer in there. Um, I'll just get you to start on something then. Just like randomly start on this shit then. There's nothing else.